Hello everyone. Thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwan and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're a brand new visitor to my YouTube channel and have no idea what my videos are all about, I love talking about things I'm passionate about, man. Movies, comic books, video games. I do hauls, reviews, unboxings. If that's the type of thing you're into, you may want to check out my other content. And if you like what you see, do subscribe. If you like what you see here, you want to learn more about me, I got a Twitter, I got an Instagram. If you like video game related stuff, I also got a Twitch. It's the same username all throughout, David A. Qua. All right, everyone. Today, we're going to take a look at my beanie collection. If you haven't checked out my previous video where I show you my hat collection, do check it out. Uh, there's multiple videos. I got like hanging up on my, on my I hung up on, on my wall, like all my hats and stuff. Pretty cool. A lot of hats I traveled, you know, so there's like a New York, California, Texas, Florida. I have like hats from different places I travel to. When it comes to beanies, it's primarily about um, my taste, you know, comic books, video games, you know, movies I really enjoy and stuff like that. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to take a look at all the beanies I have and we'll just go from there. And by the way, today is April 16th, 2020. Okay, so if you're like, man, that's a long time ago. Chances are I made another one. Okay, chances are I made another beanie video, updated video, where uh, I show like more, you know, that, that I bought through the years and stuff. Okay, but as of right now, we're at the coronavirus pandemic. Everyone's quarantined and... I'm like, man, I gotta make some videos. <laughs> what am I gonna talk about? Of course, why not? Let's set up all my clothes and we'll go through my clothes collection and we'll start with the beanies. <laughs> all right, everyone. Let's go through, uh, well, we'll work from top left and work from bottom right, okay? And we'll stack them all up. You gotta clean these up anyway. Um, this is South Park. I had a whole outfit with this too. Uh, got a Walmart. Got Eric Cartman on there, okay? And there's a shirt that matches this, okay? So it was a shirt and beanie combo uh, set. And uh, I love this, man. I love South Park. Another thing I love is Batman. So here's, we got multiple Batman beanies. Got this one, black emblem on a yellow beanie, okay? This is a very bright yellow, by the way. Like, if you want to be noticed, wear this, right? <laughs> if you want to... Don't want to worry about getting lost at the amusement park or something like that, or some type of, of a, the, the Houston rodeo or something like that. Wear this. Be like, hey, there's a dude with a bright yellow beanie. I, I, I lost him. <laughs> so if you're hanging out with me. Here we got a Batman one. Here, this size looks better. It's got the blue stripes at the top. Got a black in the middle. Blue emblem, right? The blue Batman symbol on there. Okay. Pretty cool. Finally, this is the one. Oh my gosh. So here's what happened with this one. Because I bought this on eBay. They sent me the wrong piece of clothing at the beginning. And so I got this for free. Okay. But they originally sent me like a bathrobe, a Batman bathrobe. And I was like, wait, what the crap? Like, this is not what I ordered. I ordered a beanie. And I said, like, oh, you can keep the, the bathrobe. And honestly, the bathrobe costs more. Okay. And I'll still send you the beanie. Just don't give me negative feedback and stuff. So they sent me the, the beanie I wanted, which is this Batman beanie, okay? But I get to keep this Batman bathrobe also. And honestly, that bathrobe, it's like probably 20-some bucks, you know? <laughs> Versus uh, the couple bucks I, I got for this one. So that was a fortunate one, okay? And of course, you can't have Batman and not have Superman also. So I got this from Arkham Comics, uh, which is a comic book store. In Pearland, Texas, um, they had this on sale for like ten dollars. I was like, man, I I gotta have this Superman beanie. Okay. On the Marvel side, we got Spider Man. This is from uh, Amazing Spider Man, the first movie with Andrew Garfield. Okay. And I, you probably have seen me wearing this before, multiple times at Comic Cons and stuff like that. Like I would wear this on top, and then have the uh, the uh, Spider Man shirt or something like that. Okay. Here, I found this at the Goodwill for like $2. I was like, hey, I, this looks good, you know? Blue with a picture of Spider-Man, the, the uh, Tobey Maguire version of it, okay? Spider-Man 2, is, I, honestly, is my favorite of all the Spider-Man movies from uh, Tobey Maguire. I love Dr. Octopus 
in that movie, okay? This one, you wear it to be uh, bundled up, okay? I think it's cute. It's small, though. Meant for kids. But I like the design of it. Look at the eyes, okay? They're all shiny and all that. <laughs> and, of course, we got this Deadpool one. Yeah. If you guys saw my Deadpool reaction video, like, I did see Deadpool 2 with you guys. I live streamed myself reacting to the entire movie. Go check it out. I watched the entire, the, the entire Deadpool 2 movie is on my YouTube, okay? And I, I reacted to it, okay? This one goes down. <laughs> you guys seen it. So you can cover up her face and stuff. I warned this to uh, Air Capital Comic Con, okay? I don't know if you guys remember that video, but uh, it's there, okay? Down here, we got Ninja Turtles. I love Ninja Turtles, man. So most of you guys know I went to uh, Trailer, Trader's Village Comic Con with my friend Nathaniel, and I wore a different hat. I wore a, you know, like a baseball cap with uh, Raphael on it. Well, if I want to wear a beanie with that same outfit instead of a baseball cap, I would wear this one. I have a Donatello one, okay? More TMNT stuff here. This is from the, uh, it's from the Nickelodeon show, okay? I really enjoy this. And a lot of you guys have been watching my videos of uh, my reviews of the DVDs as, as they're coming out, okay? This, this is probably the oldest one I have in my collection right here. I got this when I was a little kid. Raphael, TMNT. Yeah. This is from when I was a little kid. Okay, saved all these years. And then, of course, you guys know I like, I love Star Wars. Look at all these, all these Star Wars movies. Here's my collection of everything. Okay. All my pop figures and stuff like that. Anyway, gotta have a Darth Vader one. I have a Darth Vader hat, like a baseball cap hat, you know, with the, with the bill in the front, you know. I gotta have a beanie of Darth Vader also, so that's why I got this. Occasionally when I go to uh, comic cons or a comic book shop or something like that, I usually wear that beanie, okay? Here we have an R2-D2 beanie. I don't know if you remember what, when, the, uh, when the Star Wars issue one came out. I went to uh, Bedrock City Comics. They had a, had a release party. I wore this there and I wore a uh, R2-D2 shirt with this. And a couple of guys who are cosplaying as uh, stormtroopers were like, hey, that's the droid we're looking for. <laughs> Transformers. You guys know I'm a huge fan of Transformers, okay? There are those DVDs. You see that? I got the original G1 series, Beast Wars, the movies, okay? Bumblebee, Beast Machines. Uh, there's actually more, by the way, but, uh, but I packaged them up because I don't watch them a lot. Like the Transformers animated stuff like that. Okay. So, of course, I got the Autobot symbol on a beanie. There you go, okay? Now, what if I'm playing video games? Of course, I gotta wear a Xbox 360 beanie when I'm playing Xbox. And uh, when, if I wanna play PlayStation, I have a PlayStation hat, okay? Like a baseball hat, uh, uh, hat. Um, so, yeah. This one says Pop-Tarts on the other side. I saw it on eBay for like five bucks, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get this. It has Xbox 360 on it. I got an Xbox shirt. If I ever have to go some type of, you know, the Xbox Series X release party or something like that, I probably would wear that, okay? Along with my Master Chief t shirt or something like that. Everyone knows I'm a huge fan of Call of Duty, bought most of the games, played through them. Just recently, I beat Modern Warfare 2019 and Modern Warfare Remastered uh, on veteran difficulty, okay? Got all the trophies and stuff like that. And hey, let's say there's another time where I'm uh, going to a, a release party or maybe a tournament or something like that. And uh, I want to, you know, dress up for the occasion. I have a Call of Duty beanie. This is from Advanced Warfare, okay? So a couple of Call of Duties ago, but... Um, you know, just having a beanie that has Call of Duty, the words Call of Duty on it, that, that show you how much I'm a fan and stuff. Ah, uh, yeah! Look at that. I am a huge fan of Doctor Who, okay? Got a bunch of DVDs, the, the, every season, the specials, highlight moments, you know? So I gotta have a beanie that says uh, 
I'm a Doctor Who fan. So this is like, this is for 13th Doctor, the Jodie Whittaker Doctor. It used to have a little puff ball up here, but I took it off. Okay. I, I just didn't like it there. So uh, I just want the TARDIS, the colors. Okay. And of course, you guys have seen me warn this at a, an anime convention. Remember, uh, uh, what was it called? Nakacon. I went to Nakacon and wore this. Okay. So that's my uh, Pikachu beanie. You saw me wearing with in a group picture with other Pikachus. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. Look at all this, man. WWE wrestling DVDs. I gotta wear this. Okay. So recently I went to the Royal Rumble. I was there live. It was in Houston, Texas, which is where I live. Okay. And I went to uh, other events too, like this Rise of the Vixens from uh, Renegade Wrestling Revolution. Okay. I wore this to that event too. Uh, other events I wore this to was the Elimination Chamber. I went to Elimination Chamber 2019, the pay-per-view. I was there live. Okay. I, I, I was there in person. Uh, you, didn't, you can't see me in the pay-per-view because I sat way in the back. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I usually wear these beanies when I go to uh, wrestling events. Okay. KU. This is my alma mater, man. I went, I went to school at the school. Okay. There's been some controversy recently with them, but uh, it is the school I graduated from. So got to have a beanie for that. This one, I saw it at a, at a thrift store and I bought it for like $1. Actually, I think it was less. Because that day it was like 50 cents or something at a Goodwill. Something like that. It was like, like all red tags are 75% off. So then it became like 40 some cents. I remember that. Okay. This is an old one. Jeez Louise. I bought this when I was living in Lawrence back in Kansas. Remember that? Uh, I, I, I bought this because I was cold. And I went into a, like a Salvation Army thrift shop. And I found this and I was like, oh man, I got to get this so I can keep my head warm. Because I'm free freezing here. <laughs> got a Tommy Hill figure. And uh, if you guys remember my, uh, my, uh, uh, what was that? Aaliyah. Yeah. Aaliyah, uh, the uh, singer that died in the uh, plane crash. Like she was a, a spokesperson. Like uh, she was a, uh, like Tommy Hill figure sponsored her, right? And I did a uh, Aaliyah collection, and I was wearing this in that video, okay? We got It. This is from It Chapter 2. You may remember seeing me wear this uh, when I was hanging out with my buddies. And we saw It Chapter 2 in theaters, okay? So <laughs> this is my uh, It. The only reason why I bought this beanie, okay? I saw it at a five below, so it was like only five bucks. And uh, I wore it to the, uh, the showing. Like I went to the AMC, and we saw... Uh, we saw It Chapter 2 with my friends, and I wore this when we went to that event, okay? I haven't really worn it since, honestly. We got this cute one with the with cat ears or whatever, okay? And we got some festive uh, Christmas ones here, so I did wear uh, this one to work. And everyone was like, oh, he's so festive, he's like Miss Dame, <laughs> who was another uh, very enthusiastic teacher. Okay, uh, naughty or nice. We got this like Rudolph one, really cute, and we got the Santa one. So I I actually wore this with a Santa outfit to school to um to my job. Okay, I'm a teacher by the way. So I wonder. Now these down here, nothing way too special, but I'm just plain colors. So I got like a plain green one here. It's kind of like a what type of green is this? Dark hunter green ish. Okay. Got this maroon colored one. <clears throat> Got this stripy one as black, gray, and red. This one I only bought because it was like only, only a buck. Okay. And I got a couple black ones. See? These I wore I wear a lot. Okay. Especially this one. I wear this to work all the time. Okay. It's got like the polo logo on and stuff. Pretty cool. All right. So with that, my friends. It's my beanie collection. Be sure to come back years from now and we'll uh, see how this collection grows and all that. So thank you for watching, everyone. Be sure to comment, subscribe. I'll talk guys later. Bye-bye. Here. I'll wear one of the beanies right now so we can close out the video the right way.
Okay.